welcome back to Blazing TV, viewers and subscribers. Thank you for choosing Blazing TV today. People, this is an update on Beachy Stout nephew, Philbert McDonald, who exposed Beachy Stout so he could be charged for the killing of his first wife, Marlene, a.k.a. Petal. Also, pictures showing this man here, Christopher Duncan, Detective Christopher Duncan, who he saw at the home when he bring the soup from Marlene to Beachy. And soon after, Marlene was shot and killed in the face and other places. People, Beachy Stout nephew died in 2012. Soon, a, a year, almost a year after, he go and give statement concerning Beachy Stout killing, his arranging the killing of Marlene. People, he died under questionable circumstance. That's him and the scream there with the onions in the van. His girlfriend come home and was pounced upon by men in ambush. And he ran out the house and he was can up all over his body and died. The girlfriend wasn't hurt. People in Portland was saying, according to the news, people in Portland was saying that this is cause for questioning. That's a red flag right there. That looked like a setup. Soon as he ran out to help, he's the one who was caught up and nothing was robbed. That is another cold case to be open concerning Beachy Stout. This man on the screen, Christopher Duncan, Detective Duncan, in that time there, soon after Philbert, McDonald died. He took away himself. He went to live abroad. Yes, people. He left his job and he went to live abroad. It is alleged that he went in hiding. Why soon after the killing, he left the job and went in hiding? Something wrong, another red flag. People, look at that beautiful lady on the screen. I don't know why these men who have money, these lady always get head over heel to talk with these men. But I heard that this woman did have her money also. And this man don't want no other man to get her, even though he was doing his pack, doing a lot of wrongs with women, and she left him. He presumptuous, he wanted her to stay in the condition, and she left. People, this cold case with the nephew need to reopen. There's a lot of questioning to be done there. And in 2011, start back way back to 2009, up to 2012, up to now 2021, what kind of Portland police station they had back then. What kind of thing what, was it that some of those cops were so corrupt that they hide that statement that that Philbert McDonald Beachy nephew gives so long? That statement was given from then and it's just resurfaced after his death. People, a lot of medias are saying that Mr. Detective Christopher Duncan need to be extradited back to Jamaica to be in that trial with Beachy Stout. He need to come and clear himself because it is allegedly that he was Beachy right hand man. Philbert McDonald, Beachy nephew, saw him at the house when he brought the soup for Beachy. That Beachy drunk. Yes, people, he drink half the soup, and then he still let them take out his wife, 
his first wife. This man, I don't know, this man, he is something else. People, the news also said that he, Tony and McDonald, the second wife, yeah, yeah, he used to, you know, beat her up, beat her to, beat up Tony and because of her behavior or what. And her parents get involved in it. And soon after, Tony and, Ma, Tony and McDonald, as Tony and McDonald Hamilton families, father and mother, were shoot up. The house was shoot up. And the father died. And the mother suffered multiple injuries. Again, people was calling Beachy Stout. That is Beachy do it. What kind of man is this? Because of money, you can get away with all kind of things. But every day bucket go well, one day the bottom must drop out. Because people look where he's at now. He's unlocked down for Tony and murder. And he's preparing for trial. And with all of that there, this cold case resurfaced with his first wife. A lot of things getting this detective man involved and the whole works. Look at him here, people dancing away. So Beachy, yes, you're a billionaire in a Portland. But all that money where he got people gonna go in lawyer and spending and spending. And spending. He should have found a different way to throw away that money. Not even throw away. Give it to charity. Give it to the needy. Not to going around taking out people's life to suit yourself. That poor nephew didn't couldn't take it any longer. He bust the secret and he was talking and somehow it is alleged that Beachy take out his own nephew. What kind of man is this people? And then on top of that, they are talking about bail, bail here in the 22nd of March, where bail ago, that can't work people. The authorities need to bring back that detective man. People comment, like and share. Also give it a thumbs up. Subscribe people. Thanks for watching.